Hello, and welcome to Road Trivia, the once a day road trip trivia quiz. Today, we'll be traveling to Paris, France for a 21 question trivia quiz about the city of Paris. There are 20 questions in the regular trivia and then a question 21 tiebreaker at the very end of the video if you need to stick around for that. All the questions are about the city of Paris, so good luck. Question number one. Although some travelers arrive through the smaller Orly Airport, most of the air traffic to the city of Paris comes through what popular international airport that was named after a former French president? That is the Charles de Gaulle Airport. Question number two. One of the most beautiful landmarks in the city and located on Mount Martyr, the highest point in Paris, what is the name of the large white stone basilica that began construction in 1873 and opened in 1875? That is the Sacre Coeur. Question number three, widely regarded as the most ornate, extravagant bridge in the city and the first bridge to cross the river in Paris in a single span arch. The bridge built in 1896 was named after what Russian Tsar who had concluded the Franco-Russian alliance? That bridge was named after Tsar Alexander III. Question number four. Many famous people chose to be buried in Père Lachaise Cemetery, including the composer Chopin or the great writer Oscar Wilde. One of the most popular graves is the resting place of what lead singer of The Doors who died in Paris in 1971? The answer is Jim Morrison. Question number five. Built as a fortress by Philip II in the 12th century and turned into a royal residence in 1546 by Charles V, what is the name of the Paris Museum, the largest museum in the world, that remained the home of the French royal family until 1674? That is the Louvre Museum. Question number six, Rays and Shadows and Autumn Leaves are among the poetic works of what 19th century French author who is most famous for his 1831 French Gothic novel, The Hunchback of Notre Dame. His name is Victor Hugo. Question number seven. Marked by the red windmill on its roof, what is the name of the most famous cabaret in Paris, and in the world for that matter, that is best known as the birthplace of the modern form of the can-can dance? The answer is the Moulin Rouge. Question number eight, famous for paintings like water lilies and haystacks, what is the name of the popular French painter, one of the founders of French Impressionist painting, who was born in Paris in 1840?
His name is Claude Monet. Question number nine. What is the name of the Paris fortress, historically used as a state prison by the kings of France, and seen as a symbol of the monarchy's dictatorial rule, that was stormed by a crowd on the afternoon of July 14, 1789, by revolutionaries? That is known as the Bastille. Question number 10. Commissioned by Napoleon in 1806 after his victory at Austerlitz, what is the name of the Paris landmark that is adorned with 30 shields with the names of Napoleon's successful battles, as well as the names of 558 generals from the Napoleonic Wars? Celebrating his military victories, it is the Arc de Triomphe. Question number 11. Named after the architect who designed it, the Palais Garnier has been called probably the most famous opera house in the world. This is at least partly due to its use as the primary setting for what 1910 novel by Gaston Leroux. The novel was The Phantom of the Opera. Question number 12, created by Alexandros of Antioch sometime between 150 and 125 BC and then rediscovered in 1820 on the island of Milos, Greece, which world-famous ancient Greek statue with no arms is on permanent display at the Louvre Museum? The statue with no arms is called the Venus de Milo. Question number 13. A major event of the French Revolution. What French king, the last king of France, was publicly executed by guillotine on January 21st, 1793 in what is now called Place de la Concorde in Paris? The answer is Louis the 16th. Question number 14. Built in 1889 for the World Exhibition, celebrating the French Revolution of 1789, what is the name of Paris's famous landmark that was originally only supposed to stand for 20 years, but as it proved valuable for other reasons other than decoration, it remains? That is the Eiffel Tower. Question 15. What is the name of the river that rises 18 miles northwest of Dijon and flows in a northwesterly direction through the city of Paris before emptying into the English Channel at Le Havre? The river that flows through Paris is called the Seine River. Question 16. Containing the tombs of Voltaire, Victor Hugo, and Louis Braille, construction of what building began in 1757, took 34 years to complete, and was originally built as a church, but was changed to a mausoleum for great Frenchmen during the Revolution? That building is called the Pantheon. Question 17. Chosen because of its proximity to Paris and its central location to Western Europe, what is the name of the large American-based attraction that is located in the rural town of Marne-le-Valley 
20 miles from the Paris city center. The answer is Disneyland Paris. Question 18. First as a gold coin, then a silver coin, then as standard fiat, before the euro became the legal tender in France in 2002, what was the name of the unit of currency that was used in the country for hundreds of years? That currency was called the French Franc. Question 19. The oldest monument in Paris was not built in Paris, or France for that matter, or Europe. What is the name of the 75-foot tall landmark that was raised in Place de la Concorde in the 1830s, but was carved from a single piece of red granite 3,000 years earlier in Egypt? that is called the Luxor Obelisk. And question 20. Carrying the inscription in French, here lies a French soldier who died for his fatherland 1914 to 1918. What is the name of the Parisian site located under the Arc de Triomphe that was established on Armistice Day in 1920? That is France's Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. All right, that is it for Paris Trivia. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed all these new pictures. This uh, trivia template will make its way into the rotation. So while we won't do Paris trivia again, we will be doing um, this Paris-themed trivia quiz. You know what I'm saying. The pictures will get used for like Brainy Tuesdays and Pub Quiz Fridays, stuff like that. We're done with Paris trivia, but we will have Paris pictures in the rotation from now on. So hopefully you enjoyed them. I think I'm going to do one more with Paris video clips. That'll be coming later. I think Saturday we may do Saturday Night at the Movies, which will be movies that are set in Paris. So that could be pretty cool. Anyways, here is question 21, the tiebreaker for Paris trivia. The city of Paris, France will host the 2024 Summer Olympics. Prior to those games, how many times has Paris hosted the modern Olympics? Paris has hosted the Olympics two other times, in 1900 and 1924. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow.